In of these concerns, the FISA statute and department and FBI policies and procedures have established important safeguards to protect the FISA application process from irregularities and abuse. Among the most, <coughs> among the most important are the requirements in FBI policy that every FISA application must contain a, quote, full and accurate, close quote, presentation of the facts, and that agents must ensure that all factual statements in FISA applications are, quote, scrupulously accurate, close quote. These are the standards for all FISA applications, regardless of the investigation sensitivity, regardless, I'm sorry, and it is incumbent upon the FBI to meet them in every application. Nevertheless, we found that investigators failed to meet their basic obligations of ensuring that the FISA applications were scrupulous, scrupulously accurate. We identified significant inaccuracies and omissions in each of the four applications, seven in the first application and a total of 17 by the final renewal application. For example, the Crossfire Hurricane team obtained information from Steele's primary subsource in January 2017 that raised significant questions about the reliability of the steel reporting. This was particularly noteworthy because the FISA applications relied entirely on information from the, from the steel, I'm sorry, from the primary subsources reporting to support the allegation that Page was coordinating with the Russian government on 2016 U.S. presidential election activities. However, the FBI did not share this information with department lawyers, and it was therefore omitted from the last two renewal applications. All of the applications also omitted information that the FBI had obtained in August 2017, sorry, August 2016, from another U.S. government agency detailing its prior relationship with Page, with Carter Page, including that Carter Page had been approved as an operational contact for that other agency from 2008 to 2013, that Page had provided information to the other agency concerning his prior contacts with certain Russian intelligence officers, and that an employee of that other agency assessed that Carter Page had been candid with them. The FBI never followed up on that information. 